It's that time of the month. I'm at Costco. I'm ready to stock up on all of my groceries. And I'm excited to see all of the new stuff that they have in store. You know, they always put out a ton of new stuff. Are these earrings too much? I think so. Let's go hide and shop around. I just walked in. I normally don't go through the um, electronic section. They have an LG sound bar for 200. I'm sorry. I'm going to leave my card for just a moment. Oh, they have a couple of sound bars up here. When I say a couple, I mean several. Listen, I'm not a tech gal, but this just caught my attention for no good reason. I mean, I don't care about sound really. <laughs> Give me all the subtitles. I can't hear without my subtitles. <laughs> but I saw this and I know ear pods are really popular. I don't know if this is a sale. Oh, it ends soon. Or if that's a normal price for this, but I know Alex has been asking for a pair. So I normally start over here, but that looks boring. A bunch of protein shakes and whatnot. So this caught my eye. It's talking about breaking the sound barrier. And I'm like, really? What happened to just being loud? Looks like a screaming deal here. I don't know, man. I'm not into like crazy loud stuff. Oh my gosh, the boom box reinvented. Why do I love this? $500? <laughs> this little guy, the charge fives only, only, haha, <laughs> 180. <laughs> oh, the X boom is more in my price range for 70. Not that I'm even looking for one, but the normal price is 80. All right, let's get out of the electronics. I have a little Bluetooth speaker that we bring to the beach and that works out just fine for me. Hey, have you heard that they're going to start or some stores have implemented like scanning in your card yourself, like electronically? Mm -hmm, how do we feel about it? I love technology, but not as much as you, you see. Okay, I know protein shakes, some of you might be into it. Ooh, $6 off, normally 29, it's on sale for 23. The Orgain, 30 grams of protein. Oh my gosh, the fruity cereal, you guys, it literally tastes like fruity cereal. They had this as a sample one time. It's wild sauce, so is this for kids too? I don't really know. Less than one gram of sugar, how do they do it? That one is normally $31.50 and it's on sale for $23.99. The core power is what Alex really likes, but I recently got the bag of like the powder to save on all the plastic bottles and stuff. But if you're on the go and you need some of this, you get a 10 pack of 14 fluid ounces, 26 grams of protein per shake, and they it is 26.50. Ooh, they also have great oral hygiene health happening. You can get a pack of eight toothbrushes, oral B style for $11.50, normally $16.50 some toothpaste pro enamel that one's okay i've used it before listerine Ooh, sky high lashes i've seen this is this good i'll tell you my favorite lash is the tartlet tubing mascara literally i've tried almost every single mascara on the market it's one of my faves 22 bucks for a three pack if you are traveling, they have the Neutrogena Makeup Remover Wipes. Normally 22, they're on sale for 17. Ooh, Aveeno Lotion, it is winter time. None of that alligator skin on me. Normally $18.50, it's on sale for 13.50 and you get two honkin' size bottles, 48 fluid ounces in each bottle with a pump screaming deal this is another great one the cetaphil this is the moisturizing cream and you get two in here for it's on sale right now sixteen dollars and 39 cents the sale for these ends soon i wonder if it's like a one of those flash sales that they have they also have this neutrogena hydra boost water cream this is fantastic i used it for a while but i really enjoy laneige way more than this but this is a screaming deal 23 dollars normally 33 and you get two of the fragrance free 72 hour hydration formula. I see some spring stuff behind me, but I'm more interested in unlocking my youthful vitality. Look at her. Okay, radiant skin, increased energy, deep sleep, improved mood. Wow, it's claiming a lot over here. 45 day supply for $68. And the rain bath. This always reminds me of the woman across the room. I don't know why exactly. Wait, is this the oil? No, this is just the bath gel. Normally 20 bucks, it's on sale for 15. Old Spice, I haven't seen them sell this. Maybe I just overlook it. Who the heck knows, a four pack. What happened to these commercials? I don't really see commercials anymore. So I don't know if they're still as amazing as they once were normally $16 on sale for 12. Ooh, Harry's razors. I think I got these for Alex one time. He's still working through them. $28 normally, but it's on sale for 20 and you get one handle, 13 blade cartridges and one travel blade cover. 
band-aids it's always a wonderful price here so this is not on sale but still a great price for 198 band-aids it's fifteen dollars and fifty cents what's with all the like fifty cents happening it's normally like 99 and i can just round up so this is fantastic and it's a screaming deal i can't even lift it i cut my finger really bad and you'd be surprised at how much i use this little thing for strength all right well i'll push through for you i did it for you it's actually ridiculously heavy i'm struggling right now lysol laundry sanitizer it's in crisp linen it's 150 ounces normally 17 dollars, which that alone is a great deal it's on sale for 13.50 i should probably throw some in my cart but i have some at home it's a laundry sanitizer if i didn't say that oh the power wash <gasps> okay do we use this i don't use this but if you do it's on sale right now normally ten dollars for the spray and then two refills it looks like it's dish spray and Great for clean as you go. Okay, it's eight dollars right now. I'm at my local Costco, and I recently went to the the nice Costco, and they had the greenhouse. If you've seen the Costco greenhouse, they had it there. I may have taken a picture of it. I'll be. I'm gonna look around and see if they have it here. But this is right up front. They have some spring things, I suppose. This is a Cedarcraft self-watering cedar planter for a hundred and fifty dollars. Gardening made easy. Oh my gosh, it's making me want to garden. How, what can you really put in here, though? Herbs and stuff. I see some tomato plants, but don't you need the cage for those? It's made in Canada. Hey, shout out. Oh, Canada, my home and native land. I'm actually from Canada. All right, there it is in the flesh. Looks really nice. Last year, I bought some garden boxes, <laughs> like four of them. I thought I was really gonna be on top of things, but turns out I was still in survival mode. Okay, great deal on some planters here. They have this ceramic planter it's handmade apparently it comes in a couple of different colors right now i see the teal and the blue it is 45 dollars. and then they have this three pack of really nice like these look quality of resin planters they're southern patio if you must know and they are 20 dollars for three it's crazy planters at home goods and target and stuff are so expensive look at these these are massive this is Southern Patio Prescott Resin Planter. I can't see how big it is because it's too far away, but it is humongous. Oh, very lightweight too. I kind of like that. And it's $20 for a 23 inch diameter, I assume. Hey, the Vitamix. I was talking to someone comparing the Vitamix to another blender. I forgot. What's the one that I bought? Like the more affordable one for $100. And he said, you know what? If you're just making smoothies and stuff, it's fine. It'll last you a while. Do you know what I mean? Like I'm not blending up rocks, but if you have been eyeing this, it is on sale right now. Normally 400, it's on sale for 320 bucks. Ooh, simply indulgent. I feel like we saw these last time, $20 for a three pack. Oh, I'm so sorry, excuse me. It's a four pack, but they only have two of the sniffing options out and that just isn't acceptable for me personally. Cherry blossom smells great. And the eucalyptus smells, you guess it, like eucalyptus. Actually, this looks like it's on a, it's supposed to have lavender, like that's a lavender lid, but. Anyway, it's soy wax blend, if you're wondering. Oh my gosh, the squash mallows over here. Somebody make it stop. Stop the madness. They're really cute, but oh my gosh, $29, first of all. Second of all, oh my gosh, is he a Harry Potter lion? <laughs> They're so big. Are you ready for spring? Are you ready for all the patio adventures, the barbecues, the get-togethers? This is a two fire tower modular bar set. It's eight pieces and this will hold you back $2,500. But look at all that storage. Here it is in the flesh. Oh, it's modular, so you can kind of shape it to however you want to use it. It said a fire, it's had, it said it had two places to put fires. Oh, okay, here it is, a one, and then the other side has a two. So it's woven, you put the propane tanks in the bottom, comes with four chairs, pretty sweet. It looks really nice. It feels really quality. If you're looking for something, I don't think the price gets much better than that. Well, speaking of modular, they have this fabric sectional. It's not modular, just kidding. But it does have a storage ottoman, so hashtag worth it. It's $1,600. I will just say we got our couch upstairs from Costco and I love it. And it was such a great deal. 
We saw this last time and I guessed the price. I can't remember what I guessed, but I probably guessed incorrectly because it is <laughs> $700, ouch. But the chairs do swivel and it comes with accent pillows. This is a swivel glider recliner for 400. It might be this one though. I think this is what they're talking about. Oh, a leather power recliner, just kidding. The leather power recliner is $580. And this is a woven high dining fire set. It comes with seven pieces. And look at this beauty. She's beauty and she's grace for $1,700. Just picture all your friends and family hanging out around the campfire. This was the modular section that I was thinking about. This one is $1,400. It comes in six pieces and it's a fabric sectional. It's got the autumn in there too. Ooh, this is new to mine eyes. Wow, okay, okay. So it is essentially a cubby system, similar to what we've seen in Ikea, but I think it comes with the fabric drawers. So they're marketing this as a room divider and it comes with eight storage bins, eight cubbies. You can kind of tilt it however fits your space. And it is $130. That's pretty cool. They also have this. Heating and cooling TV console, two-in-one electric fireplace and fan for $600. Ooh, this is one of my faves. Oh, it has the asterisk on it. So this is a Thomasville Lambert storage, storage sofa. I was assuming it pulled out. Oh my gosh, my legs are so sore. That's actually very cool. Very Ikea-esque, very Ikea-esque there with the storage underneath. 600 for that one. This beauty. I dream about her at night, $450. Beautiful TV console, totally giving me that 70s vibes. We saw this one last time, it is $570. We've been looking into the Apple watches and getting the, you know, a newer model of the Apple phone. What is it called, iPhone? And uh, we actually went into the store. I just like, guys, why are things so expensive? Obviously we use our phones like all day, every day. So I understand, but also, we were also looking at the Samsung phones and how apparently they have a better technology because apparently the iPhone, Apple buys their technology from Samsung. So they're always like one step below Samsung. But for whatever reason, fad culture and all of that, the iPhones are just a lot more popular. With all that being said, we're trying to bundle Alex's watch, his iWatch or whatever the heck it's called. But his current iWatch is not holding a battery so we're looking at a new one this one's on sale forty dollars off i assume it's this one i don't really know the difference so i showed you this wait did i show you this furniture set before no i showed you the other one okay well if you want to know this is 270 dollars for a nightstand <laughs> wow furniture is so expensive i guess if you break it down to like how many days you have it price per day it's like less than a penny i guess if you keep it over the span of a lifetime they also have a headboard this is six hundred dollars for a queen Ooh, this is a beautiful set this is a three-piece bayside furnishings and it is four hundred dollars you get two side tables and a coffee table they call it a three-piece occasional table set this is really nice for 400 i think this is the matching bureau for seven Oh yes, these lovely bookcases. It is a 72 inch ladder bookcase for $150. There it is, give you a nice shot. And then let me see if I can give you the specifications over here. This one looks blue. Is it blue or does it come in two colors? Or did they just paint it? I don't know. I guess it is blue. I mean, is it? I don't know. Doth mine eyes deceive me. That's black, right? <laughs> couple of faux plants over here and these are gorgeous. I actually just heard overheard someone saying, yeah, they're beautiful, but how would your bank account look after you bought them, right? So this one is a eucalyptus. It is lifelike. It is also six and a half feet tall, which is kind of reaching. I'm not even gonna lie. They probably measured to like the peak tippity toppy. $140 for that. I think the pot is beautiful. And then this one, oh my gosh, push me over with a feather, $380. It is a faux olive tree. It is absolutely gorgeous. Like, look how sturdy these branches look. This is wonderful. My kids aren't gonna put dirt all over my house because that has happened. I'll give you a peek on the specs of the box. So this is eight feet. They're both so gorgeous. They also have this jumbo lounger here. It feels so cool. We have something similar that 
Alex found off of Facebook Marketplace for a fraction of the cost. My kids love it more than so many things. They just jump on it. If it's movie night, they fight who gets to lay on it. Like, it's great. But it does take up a lot of space. They also have this beautiful lamp for $90. And then this lamp is $145. Give you a peek on the shoes. They normally have some pretty nice shoes. Fila, Puma, Kirkland brand, obviously the best, for a pretty reasonable price. And then they have introduced these cushion slides for $10. They come in a pretty wide variety of shades. These look like really nice men's shoes too. They're $20. I think Alex has a pair of these. I think they look sleek and for 20 bucks you can't beat that bargain. They also have some Skechers over here. Mostly taking this so I remember. This is the Diamond Clean Connected Series 2 pack. Philips Sonicare for $300. I feel like these normally go on sale but um, Avelina has been asking for one. I bought her one. We have like a kid version. I don't know if it's Oral-B or what, but it's $50. It's lasted several years and it's still going strong. She just wants a different color. Okay. 170 for an Oral-B two pack. 99 for the Philips two pack. Here's 99 for another. I don't know the difference between any of these. I feel like they should all do pretty much the same thing, right? And then you have to get replacement heads for it. And this is $55 for a 10 pack. Great investment here. Ours recently broke. I'm not even sure what exactly went wrong, but we've had them for 16 years. So I guess they only last so long. And I bought my set for like, I don't know, 10 bucks. So this looks really great. It's the all-in-one deluxe. It's $40. You get all the accessories that you need. And we've saved probably thousands of dollars with me cutting Alex's hair and Wentworth's hair. I know these are wildly popular. It is a countertop ice maker for $80. It holds 26 pounds or it is 26 pounds. <laughs> I don't really, it definitely is not 26 pounds. Let me see if I can pull this down. Okay, here it is. So to access the ice, it's up top here. Clean, large, small. Is that the size of the pebbles or something? All right, looks pretty cool. This Ninja Foodie Possible Cooker it is on sale right now for 80. Normal price is 100 and it basically replaces so many items in your kitchen, but not a pressure canner because I've been looking. Someone told me that I can use an Instant Pot Max or something like that for a pressure canner, but apparently it is not safe. <laughs> I say that with a question mark. I don't know, Google, that's what Google tells me. Sometimes it says yes, sometimes it says no. This is a sur la table, an air fryer oven for $80, normally 100. This is also pretty cool, a smokeless grill, griddle and air fryer all in one and it's $60, normally 90. I was just gonna say, wow, I was watching someone the other day and they were talking about a pizza oven that they got. Obviously it was from Amazon. Uh, this one is more affordable, $180, but it's an all-in-one kind of thing. Air fryer oven. It's a Ninja Foodie again. The oven that crisps and what else do you do? I don't know, but over here they have a laundry basket with a little shelf on top and I just think this is darling. It's a three bag laundry cart for $50 and it has wheels. I love that they have these collapsible oh my word it comes in a two pack probably for the best because let me tell you what i bought the massive it's probably here to here it's a bag i got it from costco it's like 10 bucks this is 20 oh so almost 20 it's 19 dollars for a two pack they're a bit smaller but more manageable because i pack my tote but then i can like barely lift it up it's like a hundred pounds so i like that they made them a little bit smaller and manageable. Everyone these days is cleaning their produce with a salad spinner and Jen Chapin is over here like the OG, right? She's like, I've been doing this since day one. I still don't have a salad spinner. What's ironic is I used to have one and then I got rid of it because, well, I don't really know why, obviously decluttering and all that good stuff. $15 for a fantastic salad spinner, pump activated. Here it is, the Ninja Blender Auto IQ. It's $70 and I wanna say I got mine on sale for around 50, maybe even less than that. I love when they come out with new prints to these sweet little bowls. These look a little more shallow than the ones that I have, but it comes out to a dollar a bowl essentially. Can't even get that at the Dollar Tree. These are such great quality and I think they're super cute. You get 10 bowls for $10. I would like all of those snacks, thank you. So I'm just side-eyeing the clothes section over here. I see some really nice zip-ups over there. This is a pull-on active capri 
and this looks really nice i like how it's a capri i'm really into that the colors are beautiful black light blue and cream and it's 15 dollars. and then this is a ladies three quarter sleeve i like the colors of these two it's like lavender and then what color is this cornflower blue those baskets first of all they're huge i feel like i walked past them but i don't think i showed them to you pretty okay these kitchen bins 18 pieces for a hundred dollars could be really great if you're organizing here is another one eight piece pop container this is a costco fan favorite fifty dollars and they come in a variety of sizes i'll give you a real look on like i don't know i guess you can use my hand as a size comparison even though you don't really know how big my hand is like this would probably fit a very small box of cereal maybe a normal size box of cereal <laughs> i don't know if it would fit a costco size box of cereal and then some of them are just like what am i going to store in there do you know what i mean especially if i'm shopping at costco and buying everything in bulk but if you are looking for something it's for you i often see these go on sale though so wait for a sale a whole aisle of exciting things coming up so i've seen these or similar items all over instagram where people you know take out their meat from the bag that it comes in like deli meat and they put it in one of these a deli keeper 14 dollars for a two pack i'm not at that level yet not sure i ever will be or want to be but if you are they have them here and then they have these really cute snack containers it is a three pack snack container with a little handle here and i just think that's darling so they've got Bluey, and then they have some Mickey and Friends. This is really exciting. This is a three-piece set cosmetic container organizer. They only have two, wait, do they have two up here? Oh, okay, so th it's just one. So this is one piece, and then you can stack them. It's just trying to display that you can stack them. The drawers are, I mean, I don't know, it's an acrylic organizer. $30 for this many, I think is a good deal. This is pretty cool too. It's like a Lazy Susan. It's got a couple layers on there. So I'll give you a look on the top. And then this is what the box looks like. So that's a screaming deal, honestly. That's something that I've been having my eye on because Avelina is wanting one of those. This is a three-piece glass jar set. Ooh, $20. I feel like Life with Lainey has a few of these jars for her hot cocoa bar. And it always looks so nice. Oh, the bamboo organizers. So this one is for plastic bags and garbage bags. I love it. I think I think this is so great. It's $20, normally $25. I bought something not similar to this because it's not bamboo. I feel like it comes with a lid so you could also store stuff on top. Yeah, that's how it's displayed. So that's pretty cool. The lid looks like it has some divots in it. The one I got off of Amazon, I've been loving that one. This is a food bag organizer for four of them i don't know gallon quart sandwich and snack size for 15 bucks oh my gosh and then this is the organizing aisle you people this oh where's the little thing that slides so this is for your food wrap i don't know like plastic and tin foil oh it says plastic and foil all right there you go 17 bucks i feel like they're getting a lot of inspiration from ikea because ikea sells something very similar to this they don't have something out so i'm unsure of the size but it is a four tier rolly cart. It's $50, which I feel like may be cheaper than what Ikea offers. But again, I'm not sure on the size, okay? I love that it comes with a top. Essentially, it's a rolling cart. So if you need a space to organize, I feel like this would be a great option. 50 bucks seems like a good deal. I've been kind of disappointed with their water bottle selection lately. I don't know, I used to get so excited. They used to roll out a new water bottle like every season. You know how much I love water bottles and stuff. They do have Brita. All right, what's up here? What's up here? This looks new. It is a two pack tri-ply clad skillet. Ooh, they are steel, stainless steel. $30 for two? Seems like a good deal. They have a stock pot. What do they literally have like one box left for $25? It doesn't feel very heavy in terms of like how stock pots should be. But if you're making some chicken stock, you need a large pot. That's a great deal. And then I see this all in one five piece set. What is there like a steamer in here? I like the color variety it has a ceramic coating. It's non-toxic and it comes with a lid. So that's really nice. I don't always venture down these aisles, but they do have laminate wood flooring, different colors and obviously different prices depending on what it is. This is waterproof laminate, wide plank sea voyage. This one is actually my favorite. I love the color of it. We ended up getting really dark wood to match the rest of the house in the addition. I kind of regret my decision, but I don't know, whatever. And then here's the last one I see. 
pretty nice. It's been a while since I shared the bath towels here, but they're $9 for such a great quality bath towel and they're nice and large, 30 inches by 58 inches. And the color selection, top notch. They also have like more and stuff. This caught my eye at $60 for a shower caddy and it comes with a mirror. I don't know, personally, I'm not into that in the shower i guess if you're doing something with your face i don't know i don't 60 dollars cool 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 no sign of the greenhouse sadly but i do see this spring collection 24 inch by 36 inch welcome mat be our guest the be our guest one is in stock but the other one is not yes lee it's bringing me back to like the golden days of my life my youth this is for youth. Oh my gosh, this is a great deal. $13 for two joggers, a two pack of joggers with a rugged knee. Oh my gosh, sweatpants. I feel like I should get some of these for my children. What sizes do I need? Oh, it comes in a few different prints too. So like camo and black, green and gray, green and gray. Okay, we just saw that one. Blue and blue and gray. If you're looking to clean out your garage, these are our absolute favorite bins and they're on sale right now. Normally $9, they're on sale for eight. And even $9 is a great deal. And they have some more organizing bins as we go down. You can see the selection. So $18 for a three pack of storage with handles, $8 for a 12G flip top crate. What is G? Gal 12 gallon? All right, hey, you see what I did there? I used my brain. $10 for a four pack of almost 13 quart storage. Ooh, okay. I have seen these shoe boxes. $30 for a four pack of these shoe boxes if you're organizing your shoes. My wandering eyes. Should we stay in the clothing section for a minute? This is a four piece pajama set and I think this is Darling. It's $17, a few different prints. And oh my gosh, the butterflies, mermaids. They have infant as well, $15. This is also a four pack. That is so cute. Two pairs of bottoms, pants, and then two tops. One is long sleeve, one is short sleeve. Oh, I love this one. Why are there trucks on everything? They also have them for the youth. So a four piece set for youth. Oh my heck. Is this part of it? Oh, okay. It's attached to something else. Okay, so this sweater, I feel like we got something very similar for Meredith last year for Christmas. I love this top where the buttons are. They also have a nice sweatshirt with a, what is that, a motorcycle on it? Oh, that's adorable. All right, there we go. There's also some dinosaurs and Ariel. Oh, this is the Little Mermaid. It's a four piece set, pajamas. Oh, they have Ninja Turtles. Oh my goodness. Well. I might be getting these for Wentworth. He's growing like a weed. My kids though, they don't love like the tight pajamas. Okay, what's over here? Ladies pajama set. Okay, I can dig it. Comes in shorts, pants, short sleeve, and a tank top. Ooh, over here, what are these sets? Airbrush tanks. All right, I can dig it, $13 for those. They have some linen shorts. These are really nice, these youth hoodies. It's $15 for the Hurley brand. The youth stretch pants, $10 for these. These feel really nice. And a three pack of three pack of pants. Tell me more. Pickle pants. Pickle. Okay, interesting for 16 bucks. Pretty much the same price as Cat and Jack. These women's joggers are really catching my eye. I love the colors and they look very comfortable. These are $15. And then they have these paper bag skorts shirt shorts with a skirt over top if you weren't living in the 90s is the paper bag style still in i have so many pants i actually might be wearing are these considered paper bag style i don't know i love them i think they're great this is like a lily dupe for 15 a few different prints oh is this a dress that's lovely get ready for a summer vacay and then behind me long sleeves Oh, Reef Life. Okay, keeping it in Florida. I actually really love this sweatshirt. Where the heck did this come from? Where are these? This is beautiful. Even though it's just plain Jane Kirkland style. High-waisted leggings. This is what it's all about with pockets. Thank you so much. $10 for these. Then they have some hoodies for $10 and some high-rise active pants. Here you go. Here's a picture of it. There's always so many things to look at in the clothes section. Oh, a three pack of long sleeve tops 
for $14. That seems like a screaming deal. This is youth size. Oh, they have Adidas sweatshirts. These are $20. Comes in a few different colors. More three-piece sets over here for the little ones. These are $13, the Wrecking Crew. And then these prints over here are just so darling with the foxes and the dinosaurs. Oh my gosh, are those bathing suits on the other side? Okay, we have to take a peek on those, but this is a Youth BCBG two-piece set. Okay, sweatshirt and some leggings. These are super adorable. And they are busting out the swimwear, $15 for a two-piece of swim trunks and a ladies three-piece set comes with shorts too I kind of like that that's very cute oh and then behind me some more jackets and hoodies and I actually just got something like this for Wentworth at the thrift store I think this is a better price because it comes with pants <laughs> Ooh, the book collection okay they got brain quest Peppa Pig is catching my eye they have Diary of a Wimpy Kid. Ooh, just because Matthew McConaughey. Just because. You know what? I'd love to listen to this on audio because, hello, Matthew McConaughey. Go best. Kindergarten White Plane Activity Book. This looks fantastic. We have a few of these and they're great for the kids and $10 is a great deal. They've got some board books for the babes. Oh, Little One Dream Big Collection. Dragon Boy. Pop-ups. All right, let's check it. Ooh, part of that. No, no, that's the wrong movie. What, what song do they sing when they're flying on the magic carpet ride? I could show you the world. Be our guest, be our guest. I don't think they have a theme song to this one, but we love Wreck-It Ralph. I know there is a song. Ta -da, ta -ka, sugar Rush, something like that. <laughs> I sounded just like it. I'm embarrassed, I don't know an Encanto song, hold on. I don't know, we don't watch that one enough. It came out a few years ago. Ooh, Encanto got two pages of pop-ups. <gasps> oh, and then Elsa, okay, cute. I always love a good pop-up book. Ooh, the hangers over here. I'm just popping back and forth. I don't even have my cart near me. 50 hangers, best deal you'll find, 14 stinking dollars for these velvet hangers. Behind me, the, you know how I feel about a cooler keeps your food cold. They have a wide variety of cooler selection, uh, different prices, different sizes, all that good stuff. Still don't see a gazebo fire pit for 300. That actually looks really nice gas fire pit. Oh, I missed showing you all the books on this side. Everyone in my family has killed someone. Oh my gosh. It's inappropriate. Uh, you want to know what was actually inappropriate? Ooh, come hungry. Ooh, okay. Salads, meals, and sweets for people who live to eat. Well, that is me. Last night, Avelina, she's in middle school, and they had a little talent show, and, you know, people were singing, dancing, comedy, all this kinds of stuff. Well, one gal goes on and sings, Are You Ready For It? by T. Swift herself. She had the snake costume on and everything. It was incredible. But I just want to know who approved the song choice. Okay, have you heard that song? Recipes from the world of Harry Potter? Okay. I'm gonna tell you something. Back in my day, when I had a talent show, a group of my friends danced, made up a dance to back streets, back, all right. And we were unable to perform day of, they told us, because it had the words, am I sent you well. Couldn't do it. So then we went back to the drawing board. They had another talent show. That was for the kids. The next one was for the parents or vice versa. I don't remember. And we were Spice Girls next go around. So I guess it all worked out. $2,800 for this set. This is a really nice set for $2,800 with a fire table. Ooh, these cushions are really quality. They're not gonna flop around on you. This is a rocker. Do you get two rockers? Five piece. One, two, three, four, five. Wow. So instead of the greenhouse, I guess my Costco decided to put together this sliding door shed. It's $1,500. It is super large inside, but I would love to show you the greenhouse instead. <laughs> Mostly because I think I want a greenhouse. Uh, don't talk me into it, okay? Because my pocketbook can not suffer anymore. 10 feet by seven feet. That's a pretty big shed. Baby, let the games begin. Now I have that song in my head. $400 for this shed. It is a little smaller, but if you're not needing something ridiculously large, this could this could work. And it's a fraction, it's a third of the price. Oh yes, 
It's almost summertime in Costco and they are busting out the grills. $800 for this Weber, $550 for this Weber, $400 for this Blackstone, $160 for this Blackstone. Okay, do you see the shade coming down? Is this sold separately? What's happening? This is a Yardistry gazebo, 12 feet wide, 14 foot long. I love this shade too. That is so nice. And then inside, okay, so the gazebo itself is $2,000. Beautiful, does not come with the lights. And the four piece seat set is $1,700. Oh my goodness, stop it, stop it. Stop it right now, this is so exciting. Hey, 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 look at me. I'm starting my homestead in my teeny tiny little greenhouse. So listen, the other Costco literally has a greenhouse the size of an actual tiny house. And I am, I think I like this one better. Can I walk inside? Oh, this is actually perfect. It just fits one person. It's great for just, oh my gosh. Oh, oh I just hit my head. I'm, oh, I hit it again. Okay, so maybe like making it one foot larger <laughs> would have been a great idea. Three shelves, oh no, do it, three. Pretty night, this is so cute. I think I'm gonna take my thumbnail here. I actually love it, it's $500. It's an urban greenhouse, that's exactly what it is because, oh my gosh, can you just imagine? Mine would just rot in my yard, I don't think I'm there yet, but Maybe I'll buy it and just leave the box in my garage like I did with my gardening boxes for one day. Maybe next year I'll get on top of it. This is Darling. It's temperature controlled, automatic roof vent opener. Multiple shelves provide healthy plant growth for various sized plants. This is wonderful. Here are the dimensions if you are in the market for one of these too. Hey, to go along with it, they have some gardening gloves for $20. Leather work gloves. It's a two pack in there and you can buy 10, 10 pairs of gloves for 10 bucks. All right, what's the better deal here? I also have gardening gloves. I got them as a Christmas gift, I don't know, three years ago. Still in the package. I don't wanna brag or anything. <laughs> Earthworms, wait. Okay, do I feed? Someone explained it to me, but I still don't understand. Earthworm casings, plant food. Are there worms in here? Honest earth, earthworm. All right, well, if you're looking for it, they have it at Costco. $13, I feel like is a great deal. Should probably get that for my plants. I've been here way too long to not have any groceries in my cart. So I'm gonna, I mean, perfect timing because the groceries are right up here. I have gotten like five voicemails in the span of time that I've been with you. Pool, oh my gosh, Costco is on something. Pool? Pool noodles, those are from last year, guaranteed, okay? <laughs> those are the ones that didn't sell. Tommy Bahama, I mean, listen, people are coming down, it's almost spring break, they're wanting to go to the beach, I get it. We avoid the beach during spring break like the plague, but if you're coming on down, Tommy Bahama chairs is where it's at, and this is the best deal you'll find them. The umbrella is $29, the chair is also a backpack for 40. These look like they're flying off the shelves. Cookies and cream mini cakes, honestly, yes please. $9 for six of them. And then they have a mini cranberry orange biscone, 12 of these for $7. Somebody give me self-control. I want to grab those. I've never had those before, but those are sounding really great, probably because I'm super hungry. These are new too. Almond Florentine, 16 count with chocolate drizzle, nine bucks. So this looks new to me, a Thai chili mango chopped salad kit. It sounds absolutely divine. I might pick these up, you know, just for research and stuff, eight bucks. They also have their Caesar salad is fantastic. The green goddess looks really good. Chopped salad kit. Oh, it's got lentils in there, plant-based green goddess dressing. All right, maybe I'll like that a little bit more. This has a zesty Thai sweet chili vinaigrette. Maybe I'll get them both. I don't know, I'm on a salad kick. Sweet kale salad kit. And then this is my favorite, the Mediterranean crunch. Oh, so good. My salad meal prep is done. Wow, this cherry topped cheesecake, $23. It is so large. I, we wouldn't be able to eat through it. We'd have to have like a get together, you know what I mean? This cheese flan, definitely would be able to eat through it without a get together, 13 bucks. What authentic recipe for tres leches cake. Oh my heck, why are they doing this to us? $10, I would buy it, but 
I'm trying not to eat all the sugar in my life. Sauerkraut is great. This is on a deal. Grass fed. Can we believe any of this? Uncured beef junior franks, a little piglet in there for $13, normally $17. That's a great deal. Last time they had a mac and cheese like this. What was inside? Like some kind of beef, right? This is Buffalo style macaroni and cheese. Great for Super Bowl. I'm just saying $16. Great. Well, I don't know if the kids would like that. I would definitely like it. First time I've seen these here too. Swedish meatballs. Includes meatballs made with ground beef, rich and creamy gravy and red berry sauce for $17. Will this feed the whole family? I don't know how many people are in your family. This is something I really love as a quick, easy dinner or lunch idea. It is chicken crumbles with mandu sauce. So easy and so good. I love this brand of lasagna. You can microwave it in eight minutes or put it in the oven for 20, but this is without meat. It's made with cheese and vegetables, lasagna primavera, and it's $14. I feel like that's a great deal. Oh, and then these, I feel like I bought these last time. I haven't yet to put them out, but $13.69 for 25 heart-shaped macaroons for Valentine's Day. All the plants, they look so beautiful. These are tulips, tulip bulbs. Great for Valentine's Day, first of all. Second, great for springtime. I don't see a price yet, but they're usually very affordable. And what's so great is that they come in a planter like that. And they also have a money tree. Oh, I didn't know that was a thing. Okay, for $30. They have some mums as well for $12. It's a really great size for $12. Oh, rose bushes. Two pack of barefoot roses for 16. Cheaper than a bouquet. First sample of the day. Mmm, can't wait. And then I see these Italian four cheese raviolis in heart shaped. I think they're darling for 10 bucks. This chicken enchilada dip looks very interesting. It's $9. Best served hot. All the dips, cause Super Bowl is coming up. Buffalo style chicken dip. Have you tried this from Costco? I love a good buffalo style chicken dip for $8. Oh, I did try this last time. It is, I, I think she just put way too much on the cracker, but it's good. Bacon date, goat cheese spread and dip. This is my personal favorite spinach artichoke and Parmesan dip. Oh yeah. It's definitely the first time I've seen this. It's avocado and egg. Just add toast. Wait, where's the egg? Is it mixed in here? Woo, 14 single cups. That's interesting. Oh, and everything but the bagel seasoning. That's cool, it's 11 bucks. Nothing says springtime like the 100 count Costco plates. I love that they do just the plates now where they used to have like the whole set with napkins. Probably went to waste $13 for 100 plates. I'm in the cleaning product aisle and that Fabuloso is wafting. This is multi-surface everyday cleaner. It's the Mrs. Myers brand. These bottles are huge and it's $16 for all three. Basil, oh my gosh, compassion flower and lemon verbena. Hey, I bought these poppables last time, these Yasso vanilla bean poppables. Oh my gosh, are they on clearance or sale? Oh, bag's a lot smaller than I remember. Um, 35 calories and it's Yasso, so it's Greek yogurt, so it's healthier for the, you know, if you're eating ice cream. Sadly, these went bad in our freezer, but kids did like what they could eat of them. When I say they went bad in my freezer, it's because our freezer was left open. It's a whole story. Anyway, they have these true fruit. These are fantastic. $11. Look, they're sold out. Come, run to Costco and get them. Nature's strawberries, frozen, and then coated in white and milk chocolate. Cool. Sometimes they have the blueberries too. Ooh, these cakes. Pineapple cakes? I've never had a pineapple cake before. It sounds like something I need to indulge in. This is $14.79, you get 16 cakes. They normally have the huge pack of like the green, super large packs of seaweed, but now I see a sea salt and teriyaki. I'm gonna give these a try, and by me, I mean my kids. When I was pregnant, I ate all the seaweed, and now that I'm not, I'm like, I wanna vomit just smelling it. <laughs> but my kids have loved them for years and years, so I continue to buy. We've reached my favorite section, the chocolate section. 65 hearts. Somebody stop me. Wait, didn't I buy a bag of these? Did they all get eaten? I'm gonna cry. I didn't get any of them. <laughs> my kids. Hershey's Reese's Hearts, 30, almost 40 ounces. There are 65 in here for $12. That's it. 
What about lint? What do we got going on? Neapolitan? I've never had a Neapolitan lint. This is $13. I mean, I'm just saying if I had a choice. Mm -mm -mm. They also have assorted lint and this is $13. My mom always, well, I don't want to say always, but I just remember my mom having these in the fridge. That's where she stored them. Instead of a fruit drawer, we had a chocolate drawer. And now you can understand me a little better. Okay, $16.50 for 145 pieces. Godiva. Is this really better than Russell Stouffer's at all? I don't know, but it's expensive. This is a sorted chocolates box for 18, <laughs> excuse me, $18. Is there a $10 gift card in here somewhere? What am I getting for, there better be multiple layers in this, but by the looks of it, I'm gonna say not. Ra that raspberry star looks real good though. What's your favorite chocolate? What are you always hoping to get? I really like the dark chocolate coconut. Oh my gosh, you get two of them. Okay, worth it for $18. And then hold on, there's another Godiva masterpiece that's over here. They're dark chocolate hearts for 11. Probably get way more pieces in here, but the assortment is dire. You only get one, one brand. Trying out these nuggets with this Japanese sauce. Thank you. Looking like it's looking. That Japanese sauce is great. Okay, sweet potato chips. I've never seen these before. These are $6.69. And then similarly, I've never seen these late July. Love that brand. Hawaiian habanero tortilla chips, also $6.99. Have we seen these pretzel sliders before? Cheeseburger, whoa, cheeseburger pretzel sliders. They're on sale, $10, normally 15. Wow, 12 sliders though. The spicy beef patties are some of my kids' favorites. They also love the chicken melts here. Oh wow, they're like almost sold out. I am debating getting these Beyond Burgers. They're plant-based patties. You get 10 of them for $15.50. Have you ever had fried dill pickles? Chips? We have. My kids love them. We normally get them at Cracker Barrel, but they have them here at Costco. I don't know how much. It doesn't have a price. But they also have pretzel bites with pub cheese for $10. This is new, the crispy potato corn dogs. Oh, they're on sale, $7.69, normally $10.69. I don't understand what they look like. Love this vegetarian option. It's eggplant parmesan, tender breaded eggplant slices in sauce topped with cheese. Delish, $17 for two trays. This is an odd sample, but I'll definitely take it. Olive oil, extra virgin olive oil with some bread. Oh no, would I spill it? Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> Superfood smoothie, the Noka brand. We got these, the kids enjoy them. They are pricey, but for what, it's 12 pack and it is $18. But for what you get, it's really great quality ingredients and prebiotics too, and fiber and plant protein and flaxseed. You know what I didn't see here? Celery, so weird, I think I'm out of it. Anyway, they're trying to tempt me with the Doritos for $7. It's insane. I see these grain-free Siete brand. I love this brand. Chili lime grain-free puffs. Interesting. Looks like they're selling like hotcakes, $6.69. Of course, I have to grab some heavenly hunky chunkies. They're so good, even if they're not on sale. My kids love them too. I'm sure I can make them from scratch. I feel like I have in the past, but you know. This is what I was talking about the other day. Organic everything but the bagel chips or crisps what the heck it's so good we had them for the holidays 8.49 i could eat the entire container i don't know if i've ever shared this i've seen it a few times the overnight oats gluten-free organic i can't get on this train i don't know i don't like the texture i'll pass on that but they do have vanilla chia granola i'm looking for the unreal chocolate covered coconut stuff I found this instead, Dutch caramel and vanilla. It's like a stroop waffle, but with only two grams of sugar, $8, normally 11. They also have dark chocolate sea salt. It's quinoa crisps, so like a healthier dessert, $9.79. Over here, probiotic strawberries. Those are a hit with the kids. Chocolate covered blueberries, delicious. And then I saw these white chocolate raspberries, soft truffle ganache, white chocolate coating, crispy quinoa raspberry pieces. That actually sounds delightful, $10. I haven't seen gum here in a long time. Has it always here and they're getting rid of it? I don't even know, $15. I tried to look for gum when I was putting nurse gifts together. Great for teacher gifts, like who doesn't like gum? I mean, I don't eat gum, but <laughs> I don't know why I assume everyone else does. You know when I eat gum, when I'm trying to stay awake. Road trips, 
even though it's whatever. Anyway, this is the first time I've seen these now that I turned around. Taste the real fruit ingredients. Black Forest Stretch Island Fruit Strips Variety Pack. Wolfgang loves the fruit strips that I get from Target, so I'm gonna give these a try. $17 and you get 50 in here, all different flavors. I'm into it. The cheapest price I have ever, ever, ever seen. I might grab one of these just for the movie room, even though I have an oversupply. I've just never seen this screaming deal. Have we though? During the holidays? I can't remember. $17.69, it's normally 25, so I'm just gonna get one box. Yeah, you know, just one with 30 chocolate bars. Oh no, it's open. Oh, some more Ghirardelli chocolates. These are hearts. It's a chocolate assortment. $12 for these delicious delectable treats. Creme brulee. I've never had creme brulee in real life or my fake life. <laughs> So cookies and cream Hershey's dipped pretzels for $7.89. I haven't seen those before. These are great, like a healthier version of a treat, if you will. And then I see these, what? These are premium chocolate filled bars, $14. Ooh, made in Belgium. We love Belgium chocolate. It truly is the best. This is the spring edition. Oh, it makes me wanna buy it. I'm not going to though. Ooh, Kinder, happy moments. All right, this one is open, so let's peek inside. What do we get, what do we get? Oh, I, is this an assortment pack too? Happy moments box. Oh, all kinds of treats inside. Does this mean it's a sample? <laughs> $12.49 for 65 treats. It's always such an adventure inside, that is it. I didn't go to the beauty section. I don't know, I feel like they haven't had new stuff and my car was so heavy and like dodging people. I can make excuses, but I feel like we shopped around most of the time. I hope you enjoyed what we did see. Maybe next time I'll start in the beauty section if you're interested in seeing that. But otherwise, that's it. Thank you so much for hanging out with me and shopping around with me. If you want to subscribe, put a little happy in your day. I'll see you next time. Bye.